What if one man helped win a world war, invented the foundation of modern computing, and was destroyed by the very country he saved? That man was Alan Turing mathematician, codebreaker, and visionary. He didn't just crack it. He designed a proto-computer that could test thousands of combinations. Historians estimate Turing's work shortened the war by two years and saved millions of lives. But his genius didn't stop at wartime code. In 1936, years before computers existed, Turing published a paper describing a hypothetical universal machine capable of solving any logical problem. Today, we call that a computer. Turing was decades ahead of his time, a man who saw the future when others barely understood the present. But his story turns dark. Turing was openly gay in a time when it was a crime. Instead of being honored, he was arrested, chemically castrated, and later died under mysterious circumstances at just 41. Some say suicide, others say silence. The man who helped invent the computer, erased by the system he revolutionized. The man who knew too much by David Levitt doesn't just tell Turing's story. It asks how society treats those who are too far ahead.